What's the day look like today, Bonnie? As a private wealth advisor for the last 20 years, it's the Convery's job to assist her clients in achieving their own financial planning goals. When she's not at work, the enjoys leading a healthy and active lifestyle. Six years ago, you probably wouldn't recognize her. That's because back then, Thee was competing professionally as a bodybuilder. I can look back on some of this history and uh, see how my body has changed over that period of time in preparing for, uh, for the bodybuilding competitions. And that's not all. Thee is also a big advocate of helping others and giving back to those in need. Uh, volunteer work in my community is very important to me, uh, that, that sense of hometown feeling uh, again. Uh, I'm a proud Rotarian that occupies a, a good chunk, chunk of my time doing um, good works with fellow Rotarians both locally, nationally and internationally. Later this summer, the 43-year-old Rotarian plans to do exactly that. In an ongoing effort by the Rotary Club to eradicate the world of polio, Thee, who has never swam competitively before, will attempt to swim across Lake Ontario. The challenging journey was first completed by the young Marilyn Bell back in the 1950s and has since inspired many like Thee to follow in her footsteps. Thee's goal is to do the swim in 24 hours or less. She'll start in Niagara-on-the-Lake and hopefully complete the 52-kilometer trek in Toronto. Even though she's been training vigorously since last August, Thee has her fingers crossed for calm waters and a sunny sky to make her swim successful. But those aren't the only things Thee will be relying on. Since she began training for the big swim last August, Thee has maintained a busy schedule of indoor and outdoor swims and a regimented diet to keep her weight up to help her float and stay warm in the frigid Lake Ontario waters. Uh, there's still some weight training that I do to, to maintain my muscle mass. I do some what I call interval trainings, that's fast speed work, usually in a pool, usually trying to keep up with the master swimmers, people who have swam competitively for her years. Uh, and then there's just hours and kilometers that I log, uh, continuous swimming. So it might be anywhere from three to six to nine hours and I'll put it to uh, up to 30 kilometers at a time. The aims to raise $150,000 with her swim. And if she's successful, that will be enough to purchase a quarter of a million polio vaccines. When I'm swimming, I, I can see those child's faces in the water. That's what keeps me going. Rotarians can get rid of polio worldwide. It just takes a wee bit of time, a wee bit of effort, and I'm hoping some of my wee time and effort will make a difference. For Hamilton Life, I'm Jackie Van Dinther.